watch the crack. This is Gar, and this is Gar's Anatomy. Woo! Woo! Everybody say woo. It's Gar's Anatomy. Awesome. Great. Fantastic. Look what I got. I got some bullshit. You can see that. Our, oh, sorry. You can see that. Our, oh, where's my. I think this one's not. Yeah, there we go. Let's put this and this in there. Look how much random crap I have. Anyway, I have some random bullshit, as you can see. And that's because me, Bunce, Nip Day, and Kieran Dave eventually went to go and we went exploring and you can see I think I told you about this but remember when I expanded my map and remember when I found this thing this is a big chocolate craft dungeon and it was really fun and really cool and we got to explore it and part of the ooh, oh god damn it why does this happen all the time did I just crash yes I did we're back don't know why I crashed. Well, I think I did. I think you can't shift click with one of those entities, and I think that's what I accidentally did. Anyway, look how much random nonsense we got. We got some really cool things. Some really cool things. Dave, who helped write the configurations for when they were adding Chocolate Quest in, uh, decided that they were going to um, encourage, shall we say, questing. And they did that with some pretty epic loot. So I managed to find quite a lot of these loots. So I'm pretty damn happy. A hoe of growth. Uh, I don't even know what that is. Let's see what you can do with it. What? You can make an ancient staff. What does that do? It must have some actual uses. I might have to look that up because that sounds pretty good. I just need the wither skull, wither skull to... Not wither skull. Wither star. Nether star to activate it. But yeah, we've got some pretty cool things. So, uh, let's have a look at them here because I can't remember them all. But three blocks of diamonds pretty pretty damn nice. Some runes, a biofuel generator, a crusher. Like, this is stuff I all got from, you know, just like the goddamn thing. An affinity tome, a thaumium scoop, oh, some metallurgy metals, affinity orbs. I mean, you might, you might, uh, whenever I'm, I'm going to edit in this footage, which I'm going to do after I, I take a look at all this stuff, you can see it, some of the stuff that you can. Oh. Hope I didn't lose anything there, because I'm pretty sure I had stuff in there. Uh, that would be a shame if I lost it whenever I placed stuff down. Oh well. Um, so yeah, some pretty pretty epic stuff. Now, I remember the last time I was I was telling you guys about what I'm going to do, what I'm going to do. I'm really, really torn, and I asked you guys for your opinions. Uh, the, the general consensus was, or it might not exactly have been the general consensus, it's difficult to say, because there was a couple of different ideas, but the ideas that resonated with me are definitely the... Um, to... to to do it where it was, I think that everyone of every one of you agrees that the, the the view is pretty much why I built there on that cliff in the first place, and I want to try and keep up as much of that mountain as I can. But what I might do is actually sort of like delete the entire thing and then build the mountain back up because I think I can build a better mountain than that. But yeah, the view out onto here is the cool thing. I've built the heart here already. Other stuff can go there. I'll probably make a circle to encapsulate all this stuff in. The skull should should be there. I really I really I think that I think you guys are right. I need to get rid of this thing. Now, I, I might be able to, um, well, I, I'm planning I'm able to, to, to sort of use my quarry to do this, but the quarry needs storage. There's a lot of stuff in here, not just the stuff in the chests, but the actual thing itself. And since we're planning on doing it already, uh, because whenever, uh, whenever I actually get the skull base, one of the main things I want to do is, um, is to have like a big AE system in the brain of the skull, as it were. Then I'm pretty sure what I want to happen is oh, look at these. I'm going to make myself a little AE system. I don't think it's going to be huge, but I think it's going to be enough. It's basically just going to be a controller, uh, a disk drive, and some disks and an access point, and some and some en energy. But I think that. As long as I have one of these resonant energy cells and keep the other connected, then I'd be able to just basically mine all the way down to here pretty successfully. I'm going to like cap it off just at the top here so that we don't get this basement because that needs to be taken care of more carefully than just mining. But it will be a great way to get rid of the thing. So I think that's what we're going to work on at the start of this episode. And then I'll do a little time lapse of the actual quarry taking place, hopefully. And then we should be good to go. So... Let's see what we need to get in place to get a controller, shall we? So the ME controller is basically the, 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 the computer of your system. So we're going to... Oh, don't tell me this is the only way we can do it. Do we need the redstone chipsets? No. Good. Oh, I'm glad they gave the other option. Okay, so let me uh, go off camera for a bit to, sm to do stuff like get some silicon, and get some quartz cutting knives, etc., etc., so that we can actually start crafting these things together pretty awesomely. Alright guys, I'm back down in my little workshop sort of thing here, and we're ready to go, I think. So, 
the first thing we need to get is we need to get ourselves a lot of silicon. So the thing, the way we do that is we're going to start smelting up some Certus Quartz Dust. We can do it with either that or the Nether Quartz Dust, but since we've already got some Certus Quartz, I think I'm going to start with that. Uh, it might not be the smartest thing because I think Certus Quartz might be a bit rarer. Mm, but whatever, we're doing it now anyway, so why the hell not? <laughs> uh, so we're going to just smelt a whole bunch of this up, and we're going to get on, we're going to get going. So I'm going to start with the controller because I think that's the thing that you know you absolutely need. So we are going to need to get some of these flux dusts. So we need four of them. So I'm just going to make what we need for now. Um, so it's just a case of this. Um, we're going to need more, but for the moment I'm just going to get what we need, uh, and then we need. F four iron and that's that should be easy but then we need silicon diamond and a redstone so th again that should be relatively easy now that we have this i think i might don't tell me that recipe's been disabled don't tell me that recipe's been disabled or am i doing something really wrong oh it's an assembly table you need an assembly table to make that what shapeless crafting requires that and the assembly table needs a redstone oh, god so we need, uh, god damn it, I thought that we didn't need build craft, I thought that was like an option. Oh, that's painful. That's painful. Okay, give me a second, I'm going to have to make an assembly table. Screw it guys, we'll do this together. You guys haven't seen many people do this on the server yet, so, ooh, no, that's not what we need. We're going to make some redstone energy conduits, because that's what we need. So, we need to get some more hardened glass and some electrum, that should be no problem. Uh, I need to just get some of this obs pulverized obsidian. And you know what? We might put in the whole stack. So if we have 64, I think that would require 8 lead. Because I think it's 8 to 1 if I remember correctly. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8. And some of this electrum when we're up here. Oh, that's 4 singles. There we go. So if we are making... Let me see. How, how much do we get for that? If we go U on this and hope for, look for the induction smelter. Oh, uh, no, we're not going to get it that way, are we? Uh, hardened glass, is that what it's called? Hardened glass? I should have just looked at the other way. Yeah, no, that's what it's called. So, 8th one gets us 2. So, we are doing uh, 8 times that, which would be 16. So, if we're going to get 16 hardened glass, then we want... Come on, show us, show us the recipe here without me having to look for it. Damn it. Uh, we want 16 hardened glass. It would give us. We need uh, 2 times 16, 32 electrum. Uh, do we have enough electrum for that? Could have sworn we did. Where's the electrum gone? There we go. 32 electrum. That should be a decent amount of redstone energy cells. In fact, we probably might not even have enough redstone currently in the infuser to do that. But yeah, we'll we'll we'll, we'll be all right, I think. So where's our induction smelter here? Here we go. Oh, we even got some. Uh, I might just start off with four then. There we go. And put the re put the rest in here for whenever we... Oh, no, not that. Actually, I'll take that out with me. Put the rest in here for when we need it. I put the lead in there. And that's already in there. Cool. So, uh, we want to make some energy conduits. That should be easy peasy. Let's wait for this last one to go up. And we will just do this and then this and actually that's already that's perfect wow i didn't even mean to calculate that well and fluent transposer let's put you in there awesome this is going to be good so i think i might just take one of those resin energy cells put it over here for the time being in order to use the smelter let's go kill this zombie that has a fascination for these villagers and let's dig out a little space in here so we, it'll be a wee bit low but you know low is not too no low is not exactly a problem i don't think I can put the energy cell there, so we can have an actual uh, sort of idea of, of how much it's using and can see it visibly, etc, etc. This is all temporary, remember guys, because we're going to be doing our setup, So, but at least we're getting the actual uh, stuff in the way. Now I need a chest. Do I have any wood on me? Of course not. Isn't it crazy the things that you just don't have on you at times? Uh, it'll be nice whenever we have... Uh, an A system because I can just then request stuff. Oh no, don't you dare! Oh, oh, oh god, you left your god.
Guys, I could cry. <laughs> I could genuinely cry. But I won't, because... Guys, don't... You know, we, we gotta we gotta be strong through this. We gotta be strong, so... Blurk. No, let's just cover this up. I can't... I, you know what? I haven't even closed the goddamn door yet. Because I was rushing so hard to try and make sure that none of the stuff despawned. Uh, okay. God damn it, guys. God damn it. Disaster again. It's creepers on that gut. You know, we had the option at the beginning to, like, vote on to whether or not to turn off creeper damage. And I voted no. I was like, no, Minecraft needs creeper damage, is the way it goes. <sighs> Alright, so where's all that stuff that we just made? Um... What was I looking for? I was just came up to make a chest, ironically. That's what I came up to make, isn't it? Bloody hell. Right, I'll need to get a whole... Oh, look, look, all this stuff fell down here that I didn't even notice. Wow. Okay, right, well... Okay, so this is full, so this should be able to output a lot of power and output it fast. Uh, so, not just in terms of how much power it, it loads, but to do it quite fast as well. So, I think it remembers the way you place it. So, there... Oh, yeah. So hopefully that should take not too long as far as these things go. I'll be quite happy with that. Fantastic. So, whilst we're getting that on the go, we can move on with other things, I think, anyway. So we have got to remember that in... Well, let's put the necessary ingredients in here with the exception of the diamond, chip, diamond chipset so that we can have the controller when we need it. And let's use one of these other... Uh, things for the for the meantime so that has prompted me to make a particular form of <laughs> it's quite ironic actually a particular form of disk drive from extra cells called the blast resistant me drive meaning that if that ever happens again none of our items get blown up and therefore we won't have to worry about losing all our stuff now this is going to require some golden chip sets so i'm going to go in and make ask ask for these can I just do it at the same time? Oh, no, no, no! Oh, God. It seems to have remembered. Fuck it, let's just put in a whole bunch of that. And I don't know, if can you request it at the same time? You can. Okay, so hopefully it should do some golden ones after that as well. In fact, you know what, let's just make sure there's enough for two only. Until we know that we need more. Okay, so... No, that's the wrong one. So we wanted to make a uh, ME drive. Okay, so that requires that and that. That should be fine. I've got a chest, so we can put the chest there in advance. I like doing this. I like having things done in advance. Iron, glass, and those golden things. So that should be fine. I did have glass. Um, see how I always press 3? I'm so used to having my glider in 3. So that I can fly about a bit quicker. I did have glass. Let's see if we can find glass in this absolute chaos. Oh, wow. No, no, it's clear glass. Damn it, I was almost super happy. There we go. Glass, and what else did we need? We needed some wool for the other thing I wanted to make. Uh, let's see if we can find wool. Maybe, the, no, the wool's still here, so hopefully. Yes, awesome. And uh, we've got some glass for the other thing. What I'm basically making is this, the covered cable, and it requires some ME cable, which requires some flux dust. Flux dust. So we just need to do some... Uh, yeah, sort of. We just need to do some macerating or pulverizing, rather. Um, isn't that funny how the word, the first word, is the one that you sort of stick with the most? And I am going to put in sixteen, because that seems like a reasonable amount of dust to get. I'm going to get at least three for the moment. Uh, yes, so we need flux dust. Is that that and that? Yeah, we've got redstone on us, don't we? No, I, I know I had some more. Uh, there we go. There's one here. Hopefully that's empty. No, I think it's just a case of... Oops. Putting these in like this. I think it's shapeless and we get six. So that would be pretty cool. Uh, I should stick there, shouldn't I? Because this is the one I'm not using. And then we can just go... No, nope, come on. Behave. We can just go like this. And we should get some cables. Awesome. Remember, we're going... Oh. How did I not manage to place one there? Now, we need some cables in general, but not too many for right now. But I'm going to get some, just to have them. And then I'm going to cover it. And hopefully, I don't have any food on me, but it's not too big, big of an issue. How is this thing going? Is blue the most efficient? It seems to be going relatively fast. Oh, yes, we've got our two things already. So that's actually... Oh, yeah, we can actually wait here to get it. Oh, thank you, Resonant Energy Cell. 
Thank you very much indeed. Okay, we're probably going to need more of those, but I'll do them when the time comes. Let us put our diamond chip set. No, no, no. It's not the way it goes, is it, Gar? Do I have any wood on me? No, I've got to get it over here. Uh, let us go back. Let's do the. Let's do this one first. So we need these, which is silicon, flux dust, and that. So I need more flux dust. Thank God I was pulverizing some of this. There we go. Um, let us get some flux dust. Uh, it's this one, isn't it? There we go. Let's just get all of it into flux dust, and let us get some silicon. Did I put it over here or did I put it away? I think it was in my inventory and I got blew up in it, so it's up here somewhere. Now, for those of you who are new to my channel, uh, it's not normally this haphazard. <laughs> um, it can be sometimes, whenever I remember to spell it right. I use this tip whenever I can't um, find things. It's actually really useful, and particularly useful in a situation like this where all my stuff is spread around, because then you can see the silicon gets highlighted, much like this does, because it's from the add-on to Billcraft, Billcraft Silicon. So, yeah, awesome. That sped us up a lot, actually. Okay, so we are quite close to getting what we need, I think. We need to make uh, this plus this plus this. We'll get that. And then plus this, we'll get that. So it's, we are nearly there. No, do I need to smelt that, or do I just put this straight in? I can't remember. I think it's like, oh yeah, I don't even need to smelt it. Awesome. And then for this, we just do that and the glass either side. Boom. And then we are going to quickly cover this in obsidian. Uh, let me think. That would be one, two, three, four, five, six, six, seven or something, isn't it? So I'll just get seven or eight just in case. I think it is seven, if I've counted right. And we can make this blast resistant, so we no longer have those problems. Now, we are almost there. We have got some key components. We've got the brain of the system. We've got the storage, part of the storage components for this. Now we just need the access terminal and the storage itself. Now, the access terminal is relatively straightforward, if I remember correctly. Let's see what chipset it requires. Uh, it needs a basic processor, so we're going to do another gold one. Um, that should be fine. We've got fluid flux dust and the other stuff, so that should be fine. Um, let's get in some. Uh, no, here. Let's get in some. You know what? Let's just put in. Let's get four. Let's get four more of those because I'm sure we'll need them. And let's also get one diamond one. Good. Okay. Because we're going to need them, and at least they can cook away in the background. So, because I'm thinking we need some, uh, we're going to need some, like maybe 4K? I'm not sure. So, we can do the same thing we did before, where we're going to prepare this. So, let's shift click in and see what we, can, what we can do. No, we can't. It doesn't even do it partially. I thought it did. Thank God I made some Emmy cables. Uh, iron, iron, and then this thing itself. Now, that's going to be a wee bit harder to make. Uh, well, it's going to be significantly harder to make, so let's use this iron. There we go. Uh, put this in here. Uh, quartz, flux dust, iron, certus quartz, and then the golden chipsetty device thingy. So we should maybe even have one already. No. Oh, I'll have one now though. Awesome. And then that is just that plus that plus that. Fantastic. So, we are getting closer and closer as time goes on, guys. Oh, this is nice. This is nice. I'm not sure I like this uh, texture for the conversion matrix. I think I might like the original more. So, we are really, really close. All we need now is some um, storage. I think I'm going to step the 1K and I'm going to go to the 4K, I think. Depends how easy it is to make. Uh, we need a couple of these gold ones. Okay, so that's fine. Uh, oh, now, we need a lot of those gold ones, don't we? So, for that... For a 4K storage, we are going to need a storage segment, and a storage segment requires three storage cells plus one basic processor, which means it's going to require four basic processors. Okay, so let's go and just ask for yet more basic processors. Why is it going for the diamond one next? Maybe it isn't. Maybe it's going for the golden one, but it's still taking some time. Uh, okay, I am probably going to have to come back whenever this happens so I will stop recording 
in light of this absolute hazard hazardous mess that just happened. <laughs> and we will be back whenever I've got these things actually crafted. Uh, thanks for joining me along this half process. And we will be back when replacing them.